The flesh is normal that it tries to harm you, even to kill you, to destroy, make you bitter. That is approved by the kingdom of the flesh. The flesh is faithful to the max to destroy you. <laughs> That's what the flesh does. If it can ruin you today, if from killing you, so the measure is not manifest. The flesh, listen, that's why I told you last week that if you tell me, Apostle, look what happened to me, you will not surprise me with what happened to you because it is normal, unless you're from another planet. But if you are human, many things can come to you, incredible, terrible things. Because you are a human being, you have provision for that. But the calling is not to look to see what the flesh does, because we know that the flesh is going to bring many surprises. Oh, and the more you hear grace, even more, because, because you flaunt with it, and it's going to bring you. But if you measure that 30 well accented, with grace, with good grace. Don't miss the messages here. Even if you get here half asleep, you come invest in that because that's going to help strengthen your measure. Now listen to what it says. And the spirit is against the what? The flesh. What spirit? He that has its measure manifest. If there's nothing within you, if there's nothing within you, what you're going to defend yourself with? Sometimes you, you know your neighbors. I don't know how you survived before you got here, but sometimes you listen to your neighbors and they say, wow, man, I'm going from one thing to another. I have so many problems. That is normal. If they don't have the spirit to defend themselves, the flesh is going to destroy them. You think they're going to be happy without this word? And it will contradict what God says. No one that doesn't abide in this word, especially remember that this word begun in 1973 with me. It is to say that it's, it's only 33 years old. <laughs> it's only beginning. This ministry is barely beginning. This has just begun. As a matter of fact, this is like when, remember when Jesus would say, don't tell no one, he would heal someone. Don't say it as of yet because it isn't time. Because this is just beginning. This ministry is purely beginning. It's like when the plane takes off and it lifts up its nose and you feel to see if it take, already lifted. While it's on the tarp, it's still uh, a lot of turbulence. It's, it's lifting, even then it's shaking around a little bit and it kind of scares you. The plane is elevating, but it hasn't gotten up to 38,000 feet above sea level. You are waiting for it to come to a calm where you get sleepy and you lay back and you see the clouds so beautifully displayed. That's where we're heading. The landing is another story. 